You guys have seen tractor pulls, and you got to see my Power Stroke Mustang. What if we combine them? Here's the plan. We're taking my 6 Power Powerstroke Mustang to the Hillsborough County Fair tractor pulls. Not sure how it's gonna work. Probably gonna break a lot. Oh, my bad. It's a car here. Yeah. Probably. Kinda, I kinda crunched it a little bit, so if you kinda just push it out, it's fine. You can't even see it. Dave, look. Oh, look, I fixed it already. Boom, match. You pulled repeat last year at Cleveland Cars. The fender ain't gonna be there anymore. Oh, no. <laughs> Hopefully not, let's hope. We're gonna use this, we're gonna put a bigger clevis on here, but just to prove to y'all that I can weld, because I know a lot of you guys think I can't, we're gonna put this right here. I'm gonna give it the old bounce test. Hey, I heard something pop. No, it was this. There, they moved because drift car. I should really cut my hair. 10,000 likes and I'll shave it into a mullet. How about that? Spike Mohawk. Ooh, Spike Mohawk. Mohawk? Mohawk. Oh, I don't even know oh, what that's it. A I don't want to know what that that's is. <laughs> but the Mohawk with a mullet at the back of the Mohawk. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> Bringing something back that was Bringing something existed. back that was never existed. All right, yeah. 10,000 likes will do it. I'm going to regret that. I am going to regret that. Everything up here. Freaking solid since I wrecked it. Cody and cars. It's probably the shocks. It's fine. It, it, nothing's broke yet. 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 Yeah. I mean, yeah. Yet. All right. One slight issue. I've never done a tractor pull before, and this is gonna be the first time I enter. So let's call an expert. There we go. Clayton Freed. How we doing? How we doing? Oh, I'm doing great. How about yourself? Not too bad out here in Wyoming. Ain't too bad. I got an idea. What we got? You know the stroke stang. Oh yeah, oh yeah, I know that old gal. County Fair has tractor pulls next weekend. You what should I do? Stang in there or what? Yeah, I'm gonna put the stroke stang in the tractor pulls. What are your recommendations? <laughs> since you've done so many. Oh shoot, it's the most adrenaline you're gonna ever have right there. So what are your recommendations? Like, what should I do? Like, mind you, I have no time to prepare. Wait. And traction is the key. So you got some nice, good tires on there and a bunch of weight. You got to be almost pushing that limit that they're at. Traction bars on there too. Traction bars? Oh yeah, that axle will be hopping all over the place. Uh, yeah, I'll, I'll rig that up tonight. I'll, I'll write yeah. it down. Yeah. Get it all rigged up and that should hold the axle in there perfectly good. Perfect. <laughs> all right, oh, and yeah. you also said uh, tires. Tires. Street tires, right? Yeah. I mean, maybe. <laughs> Uh, that's all I got. So that's what we're going to go oh, with. Well, then I guess three tiles I have to do. Yeah, well, I mean, I can take like a grinder and like cut some grooves in it and try that. Oh, yeah, try that. like some decent grooves in there. It should. You should be able to get enough yeah, tread traction and just let a whole bunch of air out of the tires and just have all the traction. Things mm. only two will drive, right? Yeah. Yeah, for right now at Yeah, least. three PSI. Got it. I'll write it down. You even got a hitch on that thing or what? Just finished putting it on. <laughs> <laughs> should hold all day hopefully <laughs> we, we did the bounce test so uh it works fine oh, as long as you did the shake test then it'll hold yeah yeah i mean 220 pounds of pure uh <laughs> tractor pulls are tomorrow so let's go ahead and get this thing loaded we'll get it on the trailer and we will see you guys in the morning got the stroke staying ready for the tractor pulls tonight so when i took everything out of the dash to kind of Put it back together the way it's supposed to be i guess i missed the starter button now it won't start so what i had to do was actually jump those two wires together but i'll just order a new one to get it fixed simple enough i really hope the tractor pulls go well tonight everything on the rear end is ready for tonight just got to throw the hitch on there and we'll be good he does have
Well, Mustang's back in the shop, and as you guys saw, bunch of steam came out, and no, surprisingly, it wasn't a head gasket. So it was actually kind of my fault. Uh, I didn't have this clipped on right. I guess I had it clipped on too high, and it just, boom, popped up. You can almost see, if I can zoom in, right there. Oh yeah, so I probably had the clip right there. When the motor started going and going and going, this motor has probably not been at full boost since I bought it. That's why all that steam and everything else, a lot of it was just blow by. This motor has 350,000 miles on it. I mean, just look at the old, like really pretty parts of the O-Dog's intake and the KC Jetfire. So yeah, obviously it's gonna have a lot of blow by. But nonetheless, 123 foot pull. Old girl did pretty good, I'd say. We'll get some buggers for it for next time, but I gotta find either wheel spacers or something because uh, I can't go smaller than 18 inch wheels. So if you guys have any suggestions, make sure to leave it in the comments below and uh, we'll figure it out and go next time. If you guys have any other ideas that you wanna see me do with this thing, let me know because at this rate, it, it's just all around fun mobile. And uh, clearly I don't care if I wreck it, so.